This is the solution to written homework 16. Find the distance between the two points. Okay. So the distance formula takes this shape. So it's the square root. And then the difference of the x's goes in here. And the difference of the y's goes in there. So the individual x's, they go in here. So one of the x's goes here. And uh, the other x goes here. And they'll need to be uh, subtracted. Because it's the difference of those x's. And the y's will be subtracted. <coughs> the y's go in this position, the difference of the y's. <coughs> so that would be the square root of negative 7 and then minus negative 2, so that would be plus 2, square that much, and then plus 13 minus 8, square that much. So that would be negative uh, 5 squared, and then plus 13 minus 8, that's 5 squared. <coughs> well, uh, that'd be 25 plus 25. So D is square root of 2 multiplied by 25, but we were told to uh, simplify the radical, so that 25 can come out as a 5, so that would be 5 square root 2. So the distance between those two points is 5 square root 2. Okay, find the coordinates of the midpoint. <coughs> okay, so in this case, uh, the formula takes this shape. So the midpoint formula is, well, the first coordinate will be an average, and the second coordinate will be an average. And in this case, we'll have pluses. And again, it's the, <coughs> it's the average of the x's and the average of the y's. So 1x another x one y another y so the midpoint will be negative five plus three over two in the first coordinate and seven uh, plus five <coughs> so then that would be, well, negative 5 uh, plus 3 is negative 2 over 2. 7 plus 5, that's 12 over 2. And therefore, the midpoint is negative 1, comma, 6.